Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly create a narrated slideshow using Canva. I mentioned this in my previous video, but I thought it was worth creating a video just about this feature because it's a really great one. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm in my Canva account, and you can see I have just three slides, but if I had 35 slides, this would work the exact same way. And I want to point out that I have my speaker notes already written out for my slides. And what we're going to do is use the share button on the right hand corner and select present and record. And that will take us to the recording studio. And you can see here that I have no camera. I've chosen to have my camera turned off in Canva. The camera you're seeing right now is the camera that I have for Screencast-O-Matic, which I use to record this video. So I have no camera. I'm using my built-in microphone here. You can choose the microphone that you want to use. And let's go ahead and start recording. And when I do this, this will record just my slides. It will not record my speaker notes or anything else that you see on the screen right now. This is a presentation all about some of my favorite places in the world. I've lumped them into categories that we'll explore today. The first category is mountains. I like mountains in all seasons, but winter is my favorite season. Skiing and snowshoeing are my favorite ways to explore mountains. And my other category for this presentation is random roadside attractions. I'll stop the car anywhere there's an interesting roadside attraction. I'm particularly interested in really big attractions like giant pinto beans, as seen in this picture taken in Bow Island, Alberta. And so then I'll just end my recording. Make sure you keep this window open. And then you have a link that you can share that will take people to watch your video presentation. This is a presentation all about some of my favorite. And they can play it back right there and they can even see these little markers to jump to specific slides. Now, I can also hit this download button and that will create an MP4 file that I can store on my computer and then share on YouTube or Vimeo or anywhere else that I would normally share video files. So that's how you can easily add narration to your Canva presentations. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel where you'll find dozens of other Canva tutorials.